there, my name is Natalie Jones and I am the librarian at our Souk branch of Vancouver Island Regional Library. Today we're going to do a baby time. So I've brought my little friend um, Teddy with me today and um, we can get started shortly. I just also wanted to say though, if you're looking for any more baby times or story times, be sure to check out our Storytime Corner Facebook group. You can also check out our website events page for more details. So you can go to virl.bc.ca slash event. All right, we're going to get started today by uh, singing our welcome songs. We're going to wave our hands together. It is time to say hello to all my friends. It is time to say hello to all my friends. It is time to say hello. Give a smile, wink an eye. It is time to say hello to all my friends. And thank you guys so much for joining us today, whether you're at home or in a safe space. Um, we just want to welcome you to the library and to baby time. All right, so we're going to start by getting all of our wigglies and squirmies out. And this is one of my favorite songs to sing at story time. And it's called We Wiggle and Wiggle and Stop. So Teddy, are you ready? I think so. We wiggle and wiggle and stop. We wiggle and wiggle and stop. We wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and stop. We twist and we twist and we stop. We twist and we twist and we stop. We twist and 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 we stop. We dance and we dance and we stop. We dance and we dance and we stop. We dance and 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 we stop. We go up and down and stop. We go up and down and stop. We go up and down and up and down and up and down and stop. Last one. We wiggle and wiggle and stop. We wiggle and wiggle and stop. We wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and wiggle and stop. All right, we're gonna do another little cozy song called Pizza Pickle Pumpernickel. Pizza pickle, pumper nickel, my little one shall have a tickle. One for their nose, one for their toes, and one for their belly where the hot dog goes. Give your babies lots of nice little tickles and hugs and kisses if you'd like. All right, another one of my favorites to get nice and cuddly with. I went to the picnic and what did I see? A little ear of corn smiling at me. I slathered it in butter and wrapped my tongue, sprinkled with salt and pepper. Then yum 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 yum. <laughs> Let's do that one one more time because it's so nice to get a little tickle. I went to the picnic and what did I see? A little ear of corn smiling at me. I slathered it with butter and rubbed my tongue, sprinkled with salt and pepper. Then yum, 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 yum. <laughs> All right, let's do a little bit of a bounce. This one is lovey, dovey, kissy, cuddly. So we'll bounce our babies just gently on our laps. You can go high or fast, whatever your baby would like to do. Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, I bounce my baby slow. Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, I bounce my baby low, tip to the side. Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, I bounce my baby high. Hello. Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, bounce baby to the sky. You give them a little wiggle up there and down. All right, let's do it one more time. Ready? Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, I bounce my baby slow. Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, I bounce my baby low, tip to the side. Lovey dovey kissy cuddly, bounce baby to the sky. There we go. You know what, it's okay sometimes if we forget a verse or a lyric, we're just gonna go up to the sky. <laughs> All right, now this one is probably my favorite story time song ever. 
and I know I keep saying that today, but um, if you've been to one of my story times here in Souk, then you'll know I don't think I've ever gone a story time without singing the elevator song. So we got to start with our thumbs up. Thumbs up. All right. Oh, the city is great and the city is grand. There's a whole lot of people on a tiny piece of land. And we live way up on the 52nd floor. And this is what we do when we go out the door. And we can stand up at this part. We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. Take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. And we turn around baby turn around good so you can either do it sitting down in a chair like I am or you can stand up and I always tell parents and guardians you didn't know you're coming to story time to get a workout so we're going to do that one more time again because it's my favorite song and I always recommend um, usually when parents and guardians bring their babies in they have their child facing me which is so nice because I see all these babies and toddlers with their faces lit up um, but it's also nice if you turn your baby around to face you because then you can look at their smiling face and share that bonding experience all right let's start one more time thumbs up ready teddy thumbs up Oh, this city is great and the city is grand. There's a whole lot of people on a tiny piece of land. And we live way up on the 52nd floor. And this is what we do when we go out the door. Ready? We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We take the elevator up, we take the elevator down. We take the elevator up, take the elevator down. And we turn around. Good. All right, so now it's time for a felt. And I'm just gonna put Teddy down to the side. So we're gonna do a little bit of a hidden game felt today. And hidden games are really nice even for babies and young ones um, because it helps them work on memory already. All right, so we're, we have all of our houses, but um, these are homes as well, and not everybody lives in a house. So one of the things I'd like to do is get different styles of homes to use. So if you're creating this um, felt at home, you can either design a house or you can make an apartment building, a tent, a trailer, or whatever type of space that you live in. Or maybe somewhere that feels like home, maybe not somewhere that um, provides you shelter, just a space you really like. All right. And what colors do we have today? We have blue, purple, pink, white, and green. The green one kind of blends in with the back. Here we go. Hopefully you guys can see everything. Little mouse, little mouse, come out and play. What color house are you hiding under today? Do you guys think, is it the green one? Is he trying to use camouflage and hide behind? Let's see. Nope. No mouse there. Hmm. Little mouse, little mouse, come out and play. What color house are you hiding under today? Which one do you think we should pick? Maybe the pink one? No mouse there, hmm. Little mouse, little mouse, come out and play. What color house are you hiding under today? Is it, you know what, blue is my favorite color. Let's check blue. Oh, there we go, there's the little mouse. Let's take him out. Perfect, we'll put him right there in the middle. All right, I'm gonna put that down to the side. And we're gonna bring out our scarf. So if you have a story time scarf at home, that is great. You can also just use a handkerchief, um, a towel, whatever you have available that's kind of smallish. This is the size of mine. Um, it could be smaller or bigger, whatever you would like. All right, we're gonna scrunch it up in a little ball. It's gonna go into our Fist. So that's inside part of our palm. We're going to close our hand around. You can even try to get baby's hands. Oh, I'll grab my teddy back. We'll put it in baby's hand. I'm going to sing popcorn kernels. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in the pot, in the pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop, till they pop. 
Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in the pot, in the pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop, till they pop. Good. Now, our next song is to help us learn about the seasons. Teddy, are you ready to learn about the seasons? I think so. So we're going to start with fall. That's the season that we're all getting ready for right now. Lots of rain and crunchy leaves. Rain on the grass and rain on the trees. Rain on the roof, but none on me. <laughs> and our next season, does anybody know? It is winter. So rain on the grass and rain on the trees. Rain on the roof, but none on me. And you know what? I forgot to use the right word because rain is for springtime. So we're going to start this song all over again. That was just a practice. I was testing you. So in fall, what do we have? I already mentioned it before. What do we have falling from the trees? We have leaves. So leaves on the grass and leaves on the trees. Leaves on the roof, but none on me. And then in winter time, not so much on Vancouver Island, but in other parts of Canada, we get snow. It's like colder rain. So snow on the grass and snow on the trees, snow on the roof, but none on me. And then our next season, that's when we use rain. And that is in spring. So we have rain on the grass and rain on the trees, rain on the roof, but none on me. And our last season, we have summertime and it's really bright and shiny outside. So we're gonna use the sun. Sun on the grass and sun on the trees, sun on the roof and yes on me. All right, good. We can put our scarves away or you can put them all over your baby. Sometimes they like just to play around with them. Um, yeah, so I'm going to leave the scarf with Teddy right now. All right, and um, just before we wrap up and sing our goodbye song today, I wanted to talk about uh, an early literacy tip. So um, I like to do this at the end of all my baby times or story times just as a way of um, encouraging folks. And um, so today I wanted to share that by singing a, um, nursery rhymes or any of the songs we just sang today in baby time or reading books with your babies, you're introducing them to new words all the time that you wouldn't have typically said in everyday speech and conversation. So um, you're already working to expand their vocabulary. And I just wanted to say that's a great job. Um, hopefully you guys are able to replay this song or replay this baby time. Or if you know all the songs already, you can sing them and keep uh, singing them throughout the day or sing whatever songs you already sing at home. And um, of course, you can always read books as well to increase your vocabulary. All right, Teddy, are you ready for goodbye? We're going to wave our hands, sing the same song we sang um, at the beginning as uh, for our welcome song, but this one is the goodbye version. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. It is time to say goodbye. Give a smile, wink an eye. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. Good. Thank you guys again so much for joining us today, and I hope you have a wonderful day.